Can't get it twisted, pay attention, my contrition, my conviction, my communion keeps it. So we've got a question here from one of our buddies, crust up, papaya for breakfast. We've got a question here from one of our buddies. Yo, Drew and Order. Doesn't mean doesn't seem to matter how much fucking CrossFit I do. I wear the fucking board shorts, I do the paleo supplements, do the paleo diet. I'm just not getting jacked like some of them CrossFitters are. Why are CrossFitters so jacked, Drew and Order? What's up with that? <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, man. It's a simple solution. We just have a look at the drug testing protocol for CrossFit. CrossFit has no blood testing. This is the CrossFit website. No blood testing. No out of competition testing. No public notice. If you get caught, you just lose prize money, get DQ'd, or sort of silently banned. Pseudoephedrine is legal. So, no blood testing means you can do it with a shitload of drugs, shitload of gear, get all jacked up, be a fucking star, and no one's going to find out. No out of competition testing means you can fucking jack the fuck out of your system on all types of fucking gear. To get all types of gains. And no one's ever going to fucking know. And you're going to have fucking traps up to your fucking ears. And you're going to get on there. You're going to fucking do a deadlift. You're going to do clean and jerk. You're going to be doing fucking rope climbs. You're going to be jacked out of your head. And you're not going to test positive. You're not going to test positive. Because you just cycle off. And use water soluble drugs. That won't be detectable after a couple of weeks of not using them. The thing with steroids is that they work during the training. You build the strength. Build the mass. Get the size on. Become a stronger version of yourself with the assistance of steroids, but tell everyone you're natural. That's just a business choice. I'm not saying anyone who does it is a bad person, but that's that's what we live in. So then you have certain industries that will raise these athletes up, these champions who are just basically pharmaceutically created, and say, so it's just genetic. It's just genetic. It's just hard work. It's hard fucking work and fucking discipline and talk ramen and tuna fish. But it's just fucking pharmaceuticals. It doesn't make anyone a bad person. You still got to train. Pharmaceuticals just let you train more, recover faster, and put on unnatural levels of muscle mass. When your traps are up here, man, you're like rubbing your, your ear on your traps. <laughs> Androgen receptors in the trapezius muscle. Pretty much dead giveaway what's going on there. Basically, you can see when there were massive traps on the gear. Um, so that's why CrossFitters are jacked. Did I even answer the question? What do you think? I've been swollen as fuck since I was 14 years old on the fucking high school football team. Swollen as fuck. I got a trembolone deficiency, my doctor said. My ear's itchy.